Welcome back, everyone. My name's Vo Shoshat, and today we're checking out, I don't know if I'm saying this right, uh, Techie Techie Moonlit Dread. I, I think I'm saying Moonlit Dread right, um, but yeah, it's a game on Itch.io. looks pretty cool, like the style. Let's just jump straight into it. Ooh, that's weird. What's this? Mysterious, brutal incident. Man found cut in half with no clues. Asahikawa, Japan. Asahikawa. I don't think I'm going to say that right, uh, so I might skip that. Uh, a terrifying incident that has occurred in the city. Uh, a man was discovered in a shocking state, gruesomely cut in half, with no clear evidence as to what caused his demise. The incident took place near a bustling train station in the heart of the city last Friday night. According to police, a passerby, drawn by an unusual sound, approached the scene to be confronted with a horrifying sight. The man lay sprawled on the ground, appearing as though he had been brutally severed by an unknown assailant wielding a hand axe. Why a hand axe? How do you know that? Uh, puddles of blood stained the surrounding area. Stunned by the gruesome scene, the witness promptly alerted the authorities, leading to the arrival of investigators who swiftly secured the area for further examination. However, as of now, there's no substantial evidence to shed light on the motive or perpetrator behind this heinous act. Speculation has arisen, suggesting a possible connection to the urban legend known as Teki Teki. This legend resolves around the vengeful spirit of a woman severed at the waist who haunts train station surroundings, dragging herself with her hands while emitting a spine-chilling scream. It's important to note that the police have not officially acknowledged these rumors and are diligently ex investigating all leads to uncover the truth. That's horrifying. Uh, so she just crawls around on her hands with no lower body? And of course the police aren't going to mention that. Like, it's a supernatural thing. Why would they? Uh, the occurrence of this horrific incident near the train station in the city has generated unease and fear among, among local residents and commuters. The police have prioritized the safety of the community and pledged their utmost efforts to solve the case. We fervently hope that the truth behind this incident will be revealed expeditiously. We will continue to update our readers with any further developments on this ongoing investigation. Related articles. Is the urban legend Techie Techie rumor related to the incident? What is the truth? Residents of the city are terrified. Debate rages on about the relationship between the incident and the Techie Techie. Huh. This is unbelievable. How could this happen? That's crazy. Uh, how do I? Oh, okay. Reminder, get groceries. Ah, shit. I almost forgot to pick up some groceries. Okay. I mean, you got donut and soda. Ooh, that sensitivity is a bit high. Uh, yeah, I guess we just go get groceries. I feel like I've been in a room similar to this. Like in another game. Oh, wait. I have to bring the shopping list. Is it that? I feel like it's not that. No. Is it in these drawers? Can I actually open the drawers? Why am I, like, going so slow all of a sudden this way? Am I just not allowed to walk farther that way? That's weird. All right. The train? That's the train. I feel like that train's going way too fast for a residential area. I don't know about you guys, but like, it's it might just be because I play a lot of horror games, and I like scary movies, um, or I'm just a super anxious person. But like walking alone at night, it's creepy. It's it's a hundred percent creepy. I don't know if that's just me. Let me know uh, if you guys also hate walking alone at night because it's it's it's. It's honestly just super nerve-wracking, in my opinion. Maybe not. If you live in, like... Oh, that was loud. That was... Ins insanely loud. What are you doing? 
Uh, okay, milk, olive oil. Uh, oh, there was something. Grab olive oil. Okay. Need milk. Oh, oh, there was something. Grab dish soap. Oh, so you actually have to like look up and down in order to find these. Oh, there was something. Grab tea bags. What a. Uh... All right. Instant ramen. How many do I need of those? Two. I think that said two milk. Yeah. Uh, grab snacks. How many snacks? Three. Um. Konbanwa. Konbanwa. Watai hito yo. Kita kashira. Teke teke no jiken no koto. Ba. Iye. Sore wa. Teke teke te. Toshi densets no hanashi desu yo ne. So, so. Anata wa kai kara.知らないかもしれないけど、最近その話が現実になったのよ。恐ろしいことよ。え、本当に何があったんですか今夜この街で彼女が現れたら二度と逃げられないわ。気をつけなさい。若い人よ。気をつけなさい。は、はい。気をつ
I don't know. It's just so fast that there's no real reason to. And, like, she's got voice acting, so... Oh, you gotta be kidding me. What the hell is that sound? A train ticket? Well, that's not good. Can I get out yet? No. Oh, hell no. Oh, hell no. No, no. No. Is that her little clippy hands? Because she's just running on her hands? No. Please stop, don't. Oh, it's the clerk. Oh, no. Oh, no. Shift to run. Oh, my God. I have a stamina bar, though. Oh, my God. You're so fast. Does my stamina come back? How fast should I run? When should I run? Okay, I can see where I need to go. No. Oh, I'm so close. I'm so close. No, no! Oh. Dismembered? I ran! How? Hold on. Oh, there I am. That's me. That's my dead body. And there she is. Yeah, that's not good. I hope I don't have to replay the whole thing. Hopefully there's like a... Because um, there's two endings. I hope hopefully there's like a... Uh, you know... Shoot, I do have to replay the whole thing? Are there options? Yeah, damn it. I died again the same way. I'm wondering if I need to go in the back of the store, maybe. Because there is a car there, right? Maybe I can just... I don't know. I mean, I didn't search the lady's body either. Oh, I have to redo the whole thing again. All right, well, this will be the third time. I'll see you all when I'm done. God, this is actually like truly terrifying, like this thing. So I wonder if, like, the noise I hear of, like, the door opening is that lady here. Like, she came out when the power went out, and now she's just creeping right there. Or just, like, crouched down, and then she's like, okay, fuck this. I'm just going to sprint out. Yeah. Okay, so the f f like the second time I went through, I sprinted the whole way and I ran out of stamina right at the end and I will, so I don't think there's a way to do that even though I think that's what they want you to do. Like that's obviously the ending is to like try to make it there and fucking what? God jeez. No. Oh my god. Where am I? Okay, there's something down here. Please stop it. <gasps> okay, okay, this is right. <gasps> Can I go through this door? 
There should be a door right here. Like right here. Oh, it's locked from this side. Oh my god, I'm out of sprint. I wasted my sprint running around in there. I'm still... Oh my god, just let me go, just let me go, just let me go. Did I live? <laughs> I ran her over. Survived! Nice! Dude, I love that. I love that so much. Oh, yes. So this ending was her laying in the road all destroyed. She's technically like a spirit or something, so I doubt I actually killed her. Um, Yeah, that was cool. I really enjoyed that. When you hear that tapping of that scythe, and then the power goes out on the last one, it's terrifying. And then you hear her little slip slappy hands running around. Oh, God. Very cool game. I love that so much. God, this was just so good. I really, I, I wish it was longer is the only thing. Um, but yeah, awesome job. I highly recommend you check them, uh, check this game out. And I'm definitely going to follow the developer because I want to see what they make next. Because this is good. All right, everyone. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Subscribe. That's all I got. Goodbye. Thank you for watching. Have a wonderful evening. Bye. I said bye like 50 times, but bye. <laughs> Wow, 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 wow,